Uh, good morning. Um, I have a patient with me today, Trish, <clears throat> and this is a shoot from the hip um, evaluation. Uh, Trish comes in today. She's had a series of three cervical epidural steroid injections, um, and I don't know what she's going to tell me today, so this is on the fly, as it should be, not cropped, not edited like all our videos are not cropped and not edit edited. But it brings uh, the virtual patient into the room with the real patient, and I think it's good for people to see what it's like to just chat. So you've had three cervical epidurals, and I know that you're better. How much yes. better are you? Right now. Completely. Completely. What were your <coughs> symptoms prior to the series of epidurals? Uh, excruciating pain going down my arm. <coughs> Excuse me. Sure. Into my hand. Yes. Times that I. Could can't eat, like there was something holding my arm, it was real heavy. Yes. Basically, that's it. I mean, it was time. shooting Was pain. it painful to sleep on that arm? Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Any other activities that you could not do or didn't do well or it hurt to do? Almost anything hurt. Okay. You're right-handed lady? Yes. Okay. Now, um, with the first epidural, did you get immediate relief? I got some relief, but okay. it didn't last very long. I understand. How long did it last? I think it lasted about a week. Okay. And then we had you come back for a second epidural. Correct. And what were, what happened with that one? That one didn't help me at all. Okay, interesting. Then what happened with the third epidural? Well, I've had four. Okay. And the third one was the same way. It didn't help me. Okay. And then we decided to go for a fourth one. Right. And what happened with that one? Well, so far so good. Yes. It's been almost three weeks. With pretty much near total complete relief. Correct. Now we always say three epidurals. Uh, that's kind of one of my mantras. At the most, we always try to do the minimum necessary. So I, you know, if it's one, then so be it. That's fantastic. Usually about 20 to 40 percent of people get great relief after one. The remainder need another. Okay, so another 40 percent probably get great relief after two. And then I would say another 5% after three, and occasionally we go to four. The reason I go to four, it's, it's not indicated, it's, but now we're weighing the risk of a cervical laminectomy or a cervical ACDF fusion, a big surgery, against a fourth epidural. And I think that that's an easy, easy obvious choice. Of course, yeah. And in your case, it, it paid off. So um, the question now would be, how long does it last? And I will tell you, I, I find that most cervical epidurals seem to work a pretty good long time. I hope so. Me too. So the next step will be trying to just make sure that you return to normal function. Do you feel like you would benefit from physical therapy? I don't think so, not right now. Most of the things you want to do, you can do. I can do. Okay. Uh -huh. Now, did you ever have any numbness in your hand when you were no. arm? No? no. It was just pain. Just pain. I gotcha. <coughs> was, it, was it pain you could get away from, or was it pain all the time? Sometimes I could get away from it, and other times it just, I'd go to do something and the arm felt so heavy that yes. I, I couldn't do anything. All right. Um, how about the pain of the epidurals? Well, you know, very minimal. Okay. Uh, zero to ten, what would you rate those? Probably a one. Okay. Is there anything that you think people who have arm pain from a pinched nerve in their neck uh, should know, or that you would want to tell others if you could, uh, any, you know, Well, pitfall? certainly I would try this okay. if I, you know, okay. obviously I did. Yeah. Any other things like, uh, you know, do's and don'ts or any, anything else? No, I can't think of anything. Yeah, I, I'm careful on which side I sleep. Yes. Because I do think that affects my, affects the arm. I, I think so too. Well, I'm here when you need me. So hopefully right. you won't. Hopefully I won't. I hope not too. Um, is it okay for us to post this on my on our website sure. and on YouTube? Sure. Okay. I really appreciate it. No problem. All right. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. All right.